question from the audience covering some topics that maybe you guys are facing, you guys want to hear about. Yes. Uh, when you were the only one at Sales Loft, could you run us through how you got your first customers? Let's say the first three. So when you were the only person at Sales Loft, how did you get your first three customers? Yeah, so I think, um, you know, sales is, great sales is always, always works. And um, one of the things that I've run into with our team as we've grown, particularly when we've hired a bunch of young, uh, millennial, tech savvy type folks, is this lack of understanding around like pure sales talent. And, uh, you know, I think that the number one skill set of any salesperson in the entire world is the ability to ask questions. Just straight up. There's nothing more important in sales than the ability to ask questions. Now, in order to ask questions, you have to have earned the right to ask those questions. So you have to build some rapport with folks in order to kind of get to that stage where you can go in deep. Like, you know, hey, we're alike, we've already connected. Now, do you mind if I ask you a few questions just to understand your business a little bit better so I can truly solve and help and, and serve your needs, right? And so I think you've got to really get, you've got to be able to get to that stage where you're asking those questions. And then what people think is, what we see people think is, is like, oh man, uh, asking questions is pushy. But really what's pushy is the other way around. Like, oh man, David, you need to buy my stuff. It's so awesome. It helps you do X, Y, Z. You're going to get so many appointments. You're going to integrate with your Gmail and Outlook and Salesforce. And this company's using it, that company's using it. We want this award. We, like, that's pushy, right? But what's not pushy is like, hey man, like, you know, thanks for connecting with me. I really appreciate it. You know, I think we see a lot of line, alike. Uh, tell me a little bit about your environment. Okay. Mm -hmm. Ah. Oh, so you're doing this. Have you tried this? Mm, mm, mm. Like just sitting back and listening and comprehending and then asking the deep questions like, have you tried X, Y, and Z? Because I've seen that some people have done Z and it didn't work out. And given your scenario in this industry, how does it affect you? Like, like that type of thing, right? And then just listening to what they have to say. That's the ability to connect. Like, that's the ability to understand. Like, you sent me an email today, right? And by the way, there's a bunch of hustlers here that, you know, round of applause because y'all kick ass. Like, I got like five sales emails, people trying to sell me something. I think that's awesome. And, and he was one of them. I wasn't trying to sell you anything. Yeah, everybody's trying to sell something. And, uh, and, um, and so I, I think you did a good job, right? And, you know, what, what, what I'm looking for here is a quick connect and then some question. Right? Some question that may serve your kind of purpose, but also helps me along as well, right? And that's how you get the, that's how real sales happen. That's how our first sales happen. They said, I, you know, I went in and I, I talked to the right person. I connected with them and I said, you know, tell me how you're trying to accomplish getting your appointment set up. Okay, we're doing this, we're doing that. Well, how, how do you like that? You know, is this thing really helping? Because I've heard some, I've heard some bad feedback about that. Oh, you're having some trouble. Oh, it doesn't do this. Mm. Tell me more. Right? How so? Like, what's that mean? What does that mean for the business? Like, asking questions that aren't like, I know this, I know that. It's like, I'm not doing any of that stuff. I'm just listening and connecting. But I'm smart listening because I know where those things will lead up. And then when it's time to go, I got what you need because I picked you right and I asked the right question and I under, understood your needs. And I'm just going to quickly say, you know, hey, we're doing this and this, and I think it can solve this problem that you just mentioned to me that matters. You want to get started. Right? Then you got to ask something like, you know, hey, let's make this happen, right? You got to get it closed down, but that's like after all that, you know? David. 